Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me for another video. If you have ever gotten back from a camping trip or just after a day of work and taking your boots off and just feel this overwhelming, horrible smell coming from somewhere and realizing it's your boots, then this video is for you. If not, you still will enjoy the video. Alright guys, what you're going to need now to get to make sure you keep your boots smelling really nice and fresh and not the way they do right now is some baking soda. You may have the box of baking soda. I just have the big bag of it, but either one will work. Some dryer sheets. Some twine, string, um, paracord, whatever you have. I just happen to have this juke twine. but. A spoon and a knife. And that's all you're going to need to make your little deodorizing sacks, whatever you want to call them, deodorizers. So, hope you guys all stick with me and we're going to see how to put all that together. Coming up. Guys, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take two dryer sheets. Place them on top of each other in a cross pattern like this. Now we're going to take two tablespoons of baking soda and put in the middle. Approximately two tablespoons. It can be a little bit more, it can be a little bit less. Now you're going to take the four corners. Oh, before you do that, we're going to cut about a foot long piece of twine. Keep this handy. Then you're going to take the four corners and bring them together because we're making a little sack with a baking soda inside. Kind of gather it all up together. It doesn't have to be super tight, just tight enough for you to tie. And then all we're going to do is kind of twist it together like this. Take it and twist it together. And now take your twine and wrap it around and then tie it. Just a simple knot, nothing fancy. Just a little square knot. Ah, and there you have it. So now we just take that Alright guys, after you make your odor eater, all you gotta do is just toss it in your boot and leave it in there until the next time you go hiking or camping or whatever. Keep your boot smelling nice and fresh. The baking soda also will help absorb the sweat, so as soon as you get back, if you just toss it in there, it's more likely to help your boot dry out also. And the dryer sheets also have um, a strong scent also that will help your boot smell better. I've heard, even heard of people just putting uh, dryer sheets in there and that helps you know, helping, but I really think the baking soda helps a lot because it just absorbs, you know, how people put baking soda in your fridges or anything like that. But if you're comparing this to like a pack of odor eaters or something you would buy at Walmart, those are three or four bucks. These cost about five cents. And I don't know about you, but I got a lot of different pairs of boots and hiking shoes and work shoes. And it's really nice just to be able to toss these in if your boots are stinking. And in the wintertime especially, your boots really start to stink because, you know, they just, your feet sweat a lot more, it seems like. I don't know, my boots really seem to stink the worst in the wintertime. So this has been God's Woodsman. I hope you guys all enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. That helps support the channel. Really, uh, you know, ensures that more people are going to watch it, more people are going to see it. Please share this video. Put it up on your Facebook page. Put it up on your Twitter. Share it to your friends and family. Anybody that's got stinky feet that you know, you don't have to tell them that part. And if you have any suggestions for, you know, how I could, you know, other ways that you've done this or f idea for future videos, please leave, please leave them down in the comments. I do read your comments and I will respond to them as promptly as possible. I do get a lot of comments, so it takes me a little while to comment to some of your guys' videos or comment 
respond to some of your guys' comments. And if you're a new watcher and you enjoyed this video and like to see some more of my videos, the easiest way to do that is hit that subscribe button and I will put the subscribe button right here. So you guys all have a wonderful day and Merry Christmas.